Friday. Time to chill out, relax, read some articles on the internet. This is interesting. Ah. Ten reasons why you may not want to be a billionaire. Poor guys, they must have it really, really tough. Let me, uh, let me share this article and show my respects. So I came across this saying recently. It's a combination of press F to pay respects and the world's smallest violin. And it's just ridiculous. I knew I had to make it real. For the project, I wanted to focus on making it cheap and accessible to build while still paying close attention to detail and making it as small as physically possible. It had to really work and it had to really type F just like a real keyboard would. You can program almost all Arduino and Arduino based boards to function as a keyboard. However, many are just too large for this build. So I went with one of these. It's a DigiSpark compatible board. They're ridiculously cheap online and perfect for small projects like this. For the rest of the bits, I rummaged through my spare parts drawer and found a nice tactile switch, a small LED, and some super thin wire. This thing is going to be compact. The design was 3D modeled in Fusion 360 using an image of a real keyboard to help keep the look as authentic as possible. The details are absolutely tiny and took quite a few tests to get right. It has pockets to locate everything and small clips to lock the cover in place. And because it's so small, I 3D printed the final version using a 0.2mm nozzle on my Cetus 3D printer in PLA. It came out gorgeous. Assembling it took some seriously fine work. The wiring and seating is so delicate, and if you've never sold it before, then you will find it super challenging and might want to go with a bigger button and case. Luckily though, there's only a few wires to run, and once everything is installed, you can carefully put it into the box and tack it in place with hot glue just to make sure nothing moves. Now, you can't press F on the world's smallest keyboard without having an F2 press, so that was designed in as an extruded cut, and I made it more visible using some white paint into the recess and sanding off the excess. A final coat of spray gloss made the top cover really pop, and look, I'm definitely not great at fine detail work, it's why I use 3D printers in the first place, so I was pretty stoked with the final look. Programming these tiny boards needs a bit of extra preparation, but the code is super simple. I use the DigiSpark keyboard library, though you might run into this error if you do, link to fix it is below. And using their library, you can type almost anything you like, but not everything. You see, what I really wanted to do is type a superscript F, a tiny F, to tie in with the smallness of the keyboard and the ridiculousness of the project in general. But you simply can't send those characters from the board, or at least I couldn't figure it out. If you do know a way, please do let me know. Instead, I used a super handy Chrome plugin called Text Expander to make it all work. In my case, the keyboard sends underscore F and Text Expander identifies this and then turns it into a superscript F instantly. So with all that complete, just snap it together, plug it into a USB extender, and you are good to go. Now you too can press F on the world's smallest keyboard whenever you feel the need. Okay, I know this is a pretty silly project, but it actually has a lot of legitimate uses. You can program it to send entire sentences over USB, or even program in your favorite sayings to spam them while gaming. Not that I really recommend this. So thanks for watching guys, I had a ton of fun building this little thing. It's a simple project, really fiddly, but it's a little simple button with very cheap components that you can use to send out whatever you like. And if you did enjoy this video, I'd love to have you subscribe to Maker's Muse. It's my aim to empower your creativity through technology, and I'd love to have you on board. Files for this will be linked down below, and they're free on Patreon. I look forward to seeing you again very shortly. Catch you later guys. Bye.